The big story right now at 6 o'clock is all this snow that's headed toward West Michigan. And depending on where you live, you could be getting just a little or quite a bit. This is a calm before the storm. We're just a few hours away now. Things will be looking much different than they are right now. We're tracking this winter weather with team coverage tonight. Kyle Underwood will tell us how much snow we're expected to get and when it'll hit. But we want to start with Storm Team 8 Chief Meteorologist Bill Steffen with a look at where things stand right now. Bill? Well, Brian, first of all, if you're going out this evening, there won't be much in the way of snow. If you got something planned, you're going to be home by 10 o'clock, you should be okay. Let's take a look right now at the winter storm warning which is along I-94 and south. The heaviest snow will likely be along I-80, the toll road down toward Indiana, and snow amounts will decrease as you go for, uh, farther north. Now you can see we have a winter weather advisory for Ottawa and Allegan County off to the east. That includes Grand Rapids, Lansing, Flint, and north of Kent County, there are no advisories in effect. Snowfall totals will be lighter there. Well, let's take a look then at uh, what we expect across the area. As you can see, we've got a good amount of uh, snow uh, across the region here. And uh, I think we're gonna, we will continue to be seeing the uh, snow across the area here uh, for uh, off to the west of us. That's where the uh, warning is in effect here from Chicago back to the west. Just some flurries out there now at the current time. There's the snow off to the west. That's about four hours away from us. So again, late uh, tonight especially and very early tomorrow is when the snow will hit. And Kyle's got more on that. Uh, Bill, again, for most of us, a dry evening. We are seeing some lake effect snow flurries out there right now, but the heavier snow doesn't roll into until late tonight. Nine or ten at the earliest for Benton Harbor, and here we are at midnight, snow moving into Kent County, Battle Creek, and it just overspreads all of West Michigan overnight. I think the heaviest rounds of snow will actually come between midnight and 8 a.m., which means when you look at the morning picture here tomorrow, some pretty heavy snow will have already fallen along I-94 south toward the Indiana State Line. There could be some pretty significant school closures and travel delays and travel headaches, especially from I-96 to the south tomorrow. That pushes out late in the afternoon, but in its wake, 8 to 10 inches for Kalamazoo Battle Creek south toward the Indiana State Line and about 3 to 5 for Muskegon and Grand Rapids and more snow is on the way this weekend.